Ok, very good. Eh, permíteme un segundito, que tengo unos problemas técnicos por acá. Déjenme ver un segundito por acá. Producción, producción. Production, sí, permítame. Es que se detuvo la grabación. No sé qué pasó, no sé qué hice, que detuve la grabación. Quiero ver, revisar si está activa. Ok, muy bien, creo que está bien. Espero que, que al final les pueda grabar todo el video, porque es necesario subirlo para que lo repasen ustedes. Permítame. Hoy sí, vamos a compartir nuevamente, perdón por el oso. Pero no me refiero al oso de la princesa de Cindy, es otro oso el que cometí, ¿verdad? <ríe> ok. Ahora sí. Uh -huh. Permítame. Ok. Todo era porque quería aplaudirle, ¿verdad? <ríe> A Beatriz y a Gil. Entonces, sin querer, apreté algo que no debía haber apretado ahí. <risa> ok, pero ahí están los aplausos, ¿yes? Para ustedes, claro. Ok, eh, todos los demás también pueden ir ahí a donde dice reacciones y denle aplauso a los... Ah, oh, ahí está Saúl, ¿verdad? Thank you, Saúl, thank you very much. Ok. Espero no me van a rega regañar mis jefes que me equivoqué aquí. <risa> pero ya se está grabando la, la, la presentación. Déjenme ver, aquí estamos, ok. Good. Now let's continue, please. Let's continue. Uh, the next couple is going to be. Uh, permítame que tengo varios chicos que no están presentes ahora, ¿verdad? Uh, okay. Eduardo and Luis Alejandro. Yes. Okay. Please. Okay. Eduardo and Alejandro. Eduardo, you are Marcia, and Alejandro, you are Luke. Okay. Ready? Okay. Uh, uh, and by the way. Eh, hay una ciudad en Santa Ana que se llama Calzontes Abajo, ¿verdad? Por favor, verifiquen en Google, si no me creen. Y esta otra ciudad que se llama Calzontes Arriba. Eso es en, en la falda del volcán y la Matepec, por aquellos que no me creen, ¿verdad? Eso es, búsquenlo en Google. Así que vamos, desde ahí vamos a dar la inauguración al siguiente, ok. Ladies and gentlemen, directly from Calzontes Arriba, action. Please send this package. Yes, ma'am. Do you need anything new? Actually, yes. Please write a memo about the new date for the general meeting. Right away. Give me one of those memo stickers, please. Sure. Here you go. Oh, and look. Please supervise the new interns. Absolutely. Congratulations, right? And uh, listen, here you can have many reactions uh, if you want, right? Uh, cuando los compañeros participen, pueden, por favorcito, darle reacciones, ¿verdad? Y para apoyarlo, ¿verdad? Yo para apoyarlos, Eduardo y Alejandro, les voy a, les voy a dar este efecto aquí, ¿verdad? Congratulations. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, nice. Por ahí está Beatriz dando sus reacciones también, ¿verdad? Thank you very much, Beatriz, for your, your participation here, right? And also with here with my mustache, right? Yes, I have a mustache. <laughs> okay, good. Now, Let's continue with the next couple. The next couple. Let me see who's next. Mm, we have um, Mario, right? Emmanuel. Emmanuel, you are Marcia, and Mar uh, Mario, you look. Ready? One, two, three, action. Manuel, ready? Okay, I see Mario is ready, but I don't know. Es que no, no llego. Internet. Okay, no problem, Manuel. No problem, Manuel. I understand. 
So, 20 minutes uh, or 15. No, okay, good, no problem. So, Oscar, help me, please. Oscar, you're going to be March. En un retorno, creo, no sé. Hello, hello, one, two, three. Okay, ya, ya se pasó, okay. So, Oscar, you're going to be Marsha, and Mario, you're going to be Luke. Ready, okay. Oscar? Okay, yeah. one, two, three, action. Please send this package. Yes, ma'am. Do you need anything else? Actually, yes. Please write a memo about the new day for the general meeting. Uh, right away. Give me one of those memo stickers, please. Sure. As you go out and look, please supervise the new printer. Absolutely. Okie dokie, thank you. Mejor le damos el aplauso físico, no va a ser que me equivoque otra vez. <laughs> okay. Thank you, thank you very much. And to finish, uh, Solo Carlos Enrique, me falta. ¿Falta alguien más? ¿Alguien que no haya participado, chicos? Aparte de Carlos Enrique. ¿Nadie más? Ok, good. So, Carlos Enrique, I am Marcia, and you are Luke, right? Ready, Carlos Enrique? Now, eh, please send this package. Carlos Enrique, ah, Cindy, you participate, right? No, Cindy no ha participado todavía. Sí, fui la primera. Ah, ah yes, 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 I remember, yes, I remember, sorry. Hey, Carlos Enrique, can you copy? 10-4, 10-4. No, no sé qué pasó con Carlos Enrique, bueno. Entonces sí, sigamos. Creo que tenía un inconveniente. Ah, sí, sí, permítame. Es que con tanta cosa aquí, de, no he leído, lo, excuse me, déjame comer. Ah, Carlos, pero este fue Carlos, ahora, pero Carlos ya está con nosotros, sí. Luego Jennifer dice, teacher, disculpe, estoy conectado, ok. Beatriz, sí, Beatriz ya está conectada, muy bien. Y Eduardo que dice que se peleó con el vecino, que le ha cortado el internet, <risa> ok. No, 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 de Carlos Enrique no tengo mensaje, quizás se ha levantado un ratito, Carlos Enrique, ok. Muy bien, después vamos a hacerlo participar. Ok, let's continue. Look, here we have these commands. Let's watch the conversation, right? Let's watch the conversation and help me completing these sentences. The sentences are incomplete. So, number one, a memo about the new date. Write it. Write a memo, okay? Write a memo. Write a memo about the new date. That's it, right? Uh, next one. Give me. me. Give me. Give me. Baby, you can give it to me. I give it to you. Okay, give me. Give me, give me. Now, next one. The new interns. Supervised. Supervised. Oops. Supervise the new intern, right? Supervise the new intern. Okay, good. So class, these are examples of commands. Or oh, we can say examples of uh, imperatives, right? Imperatives. Now go and check the, the grammar here, right? Commands. Commands are direct instructions or orders to do something. They have the same structure as imperative, right? The commands are similar to the, to the imperative, right? Okay. Can you repeat this, please, Cindy? Repeat. Read again, please. Commands. Commands. They are. They are. Continue, continue. 
di direct instruction or orders to do something they have the same structure as imperatives thank you very much thank you very much now use please plus the command to sound more polite si usted está dando instrucciones a sus compañeros o a sus empleados como vimos ahí que es Saúl y y Carlos eh, Enrique son, son jefes, entonces y no quieren sonar tan pesado con los empleados, pues pueden usar la palabra please, right? To sound more polite. Please place an order for more boxes. Call the supervisor, please. O I can say to Eduardo, right? Eduardo, please give me some meat. <laughs> okay? So you use the command Look, call, place, and you use the word please. Okay, now, uh, Carlos, please, can you read the information again? Use please, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Read, Carlos. Use please the com plus the command equal to some more polite. Please. Polite, polite. Mm. Please. No, please, please. Yes, place, place. An order for more boxes. Call the supervision, please. Okay, thank you very much, right? Do you understand, class? Thank you. Now, do you understand what is a command? And please, you, please use please. <laughs> When you want to give a command and make it more polite, hacerlo más amable, right? Okay, let's continue, right? Now, here we have, look, use commands without a subject to give instructions and order, right? Usamos comandos o imperativos, right? Sin el sujeto, no subject, to give instructions and order, right? Example, right? Uh, affirmative. Go to the corner. Open the window. It's slow, right? Sometimes we we need to go to work and we are okay. Hey, it's slowly. It's slowly. <laughs> then turn right. Turn right. Turn left. So when you're giving instructions in the negative, we use the word don't to make negative, right? So say, don't go to the corner. Affirmative, go to the corner. Negative, don't go to the corner, right? Don't turn left. Don't walk too fast. And don't turn on the TV. Don't turn on the TV, right? Good. Repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Go to the corner. Open the window. Eat slowly. Turn right. Don't go to the corner. Don't turn left. Don't walk too fast. Don't turn on the TV. Okay. Any question? Do you have questions? No question, teacher. Good. Now, the most important part here is that you don't use a subject. You don't say, Pedrito, go to the corner, or they go to the corner, no? Only the verb. Solo usamos el verbo, right? And in the negative, all the time we say don't, 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 right? Good. Now, it's time to work. Unscramble the directions, please. It says client, order, take the, to the, ah, okay, so take the order to the client. 
Mm -hmm. Now, number two, please. Can you help me? Identify the verb and then we we complete with the next, right? I will give you some minutes. Uh huh. Okay, please. Send a report to the company. Send the report to the company. Let me see. Uh, please send the report to the company. Nice. Excellent also, right? Please send the report to the company. Oh, you can say like this. Look. Other example is send the report to the company. Please. Come. Please, correct. Mm. Please, right? Excellent also. Okay, number three. Volunteers. Don't call the supervisor. Don't, Don't call, call the supervisor. Call the supervisor. The supervisor. The supervisor, right? Don't call the supervisor. Hmm? No. It's negative, right? Excellent. Also, I like it. Number four. I le puso dos com o así Let me see, please don't come. Oh, yes, it's a mistake. Excuse me. Corrijámoslo entonces. Ah, pero no. No lo puedo correr porque si me escucho, se me va a borrar lo que, lo que hicieron ahí. Entonces, okay, okay. ignorémoslo aquí. Es más, aquí lo voy a tachar, permítame. Ok. Very good. Aquí podemos inventar. Don't the light on, please. Ajá. Don't. Don't the light on, please. Don't come. To the light. Don't come late. Ah, there is another. Ya hay otro otro error. Permítame. Don't do the light complete. Wait, give me a second. Permítame. Aquí estaba un poco dormido cuando estaba haciendo esta presentación. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Let me see. Don't come late, please. Me, me hace falta el bueno el café ya me lo estoy tomando, pero la semita es la que me falta. <laughs> Okay. Good. Now. Hoy, hoy sí, ya estamos listos. No, Don't. Que sí tenemos semita. Don't come late, please. <laughs> Don't, come. Don't come late, please. Okay. Ahí están bien preparados con la semita, ¿verdad? Y se, no, ¿Por qué será que a todo el pan le dicen nombre de mujer, verdad? Margarita, Magdalena. María Luisa. No, no, María Luisa. Ajá. Perecha. Ajá, no, ese no. Viejita. Viejita. Según la historia, nosotros también. que. Según la historia, nosotros que podemos hacer pan francés y dulce es Ajá. porque era un arte neto, neto de las mujeres. Y ah. aquella que inventaba un pan le ponían el nombre de ella cuando empezaron sí. a hacer el pan. Buen dato. Excelentoso. Buen dato, sí. Es decir, que ellas empezaron a ponerle nombre a sus panes, a lo que hacían, ¿verdad? O sea, okay. que si usted hace un cohete a la luna, usted le puede poner su nombre. Sí, sí. no, pero mire, Eduardo, lo que me pregunto yo es quién se llamaba Semita, porque me puso así el pan. <risa> o Pepe, o Pepe Recha, <risa> Buena, buena, pero... <risa> no, pero aparte de la peperecha está la honrada también, que se hace con azúcar blanca, ¿verdad? La honrada, sí. <risa> o o el Ejoto. <laughs> okay, very good. Let's go to number five, please. Number five. The supervisor okay. employers. Give me a second. Ah, okay, good. Okay. Uh, the supervisor supervise, employers. Employer. Supervise the employees. Employees, right? Okay. Congratulations, that's it, right? Any question about the use of imperatives? Questions? Todo claro como el orchata. Adito job, mamón. <laughs> okay, very good. Alguien está ahí de romántico. 
No, come on. Es con mi hija, es con mi hija. <laughs> okay. Very good. Now, let's go to the next part. Good. Change is negative to an affirmative, right? Change. Hola, hola. Dicha, ¿será que a mi vecino le está pasando internet? A mí, a mí sale como fijado. Lo dejó aquí para dejar la semita. <risa> Tres <el> café, güey. <risa> Tres la semita, de venir. Salió, salió, del, salió de, la, de, de la sala, dice. Se lo desconectó, quizás. Creo que está agarrando señal de mi vecino. Hello, hello. Do you copy? Do you copy? Hello, hello. Yes. Yes. I copy. Uh, teacher, deja agarrarle señal a mi vecino. Eh, listen, eh, me acabo de pelear con el vecino también. Ya me acaba de cortar ahí, pero le dije que. Se cambió la clave al wifi. <laughs> okay. I'm no, sorry. I'm sorry, class. <laughs> le, le llevé un pedazo de semita para que me regresara ahí la señal. Okay, no, I'm sorry, seriously, I'm sorry for the for the interruption. Now let's continue. Let's continue with the present. Otra semita. No hay el panadero. Otra vez salió, creo yo, ¿verdad? No, ahí está, está metido. Teacher. Ahí viene otra vez. Hello again, I'm sorry again. Uh, creo que quiere más semita el vecino, no le bastó la que le ve. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ok, vamos a ver si ahora podemos. Si vuelvo a irse, me esperan, por favor. Sorry, van a disculpar que ya no está en mis manos. Ok, here, right? Now, can you see the screen? Hoy sí pueden ver la, la pantalla. Yes. Yes, ok, very good. Yes. So, number two, don't go to the meeting. What is the, the affirmative for don't go to the meeting? Please, volunteers. 
Go to the meeting. Go to the meeting. Very good. Thank you. And now, don't write the email. Write the email. Write the email. Write the email, right? Okay. Very good. Now, next one. Work. Change each affirmative into... So, in this case, it's the opposite. We're going to have affirmative to negative, right? Example. Write the memo to the boss. Negative. Don't write the memo to the boss, right? Number two. Volunteers, please. Don't supervise the employees. Don't supervise the new employees. The new employees, right? Okay. Good. Repair the computer. Don't repair the computer. Don't repair the computer, right? Okay. And Don't number four. The orders to the client. Don't send the orders to the to client. The client. client. Uh-huh. That's it, right? I'm sorry, it's too late for the attendance. I will take the attendance very fast. Read this and say present, please. Carlos? Yes, teacher. Okay, thank you. Cindy? Yes. Okay, thank you. Cristina? Christy? No, right? Joshua? Esaú. Present. Thank you. Elizabeth. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jill. Present. Very good. Giovanni. Yeah, teacher. Oh, hello, Giovanni. Welcome. Ex Excellent also. Okay, welcome, Giovanni. Okay, puede participar, ¿verdad, Giovanni? Sí, solo cinco yes. minutos. Y okay, luego. five minutes. Okay, no problem, no problem, Giovanni. Uh, Beatriz. Present. Thank you. Jennifer. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge. Present teacher. Enrique, bueno, Enrique ya sabemos que está, perdón. Incapacitado. Okay, Eduardo. Present. Edu Thank you. Uh, Alejandro. Here, teacher. Thank you, Manuel. Present teacher. Mario. Present. Thank you. Andrés. Bueno, eh, me, le, me le dicen ahí los muchachos de, de Abang, ¿verdad? En Abang están, están ¿verdad? Eh, que por favor se haga presente, don Andrés, que lo necesitamos. <ríe> ok. No, a saber qué le pasó a Andrés, ¿verdad? Eh, Oscar. Thank you. Victor. Victor Alejandro. Ok. Carlos Enrique. Carlos Enrique. Ok. Very good. Now let's continue, right? Uh, we're going to play a game. Vamos a hacer un jueguito, se llama Ahorcado, The Hangman, right? And we are going to ask some students. Ahora vamos a realizar el listado de abajo para arriba, ¿verdad? Al revés. Eh, Carlos Enrique, no sé, creo que se ha levantado, pero vamos a comenzar con eh, Oscar. Oscar, please. Eh, I need you give me one letter from the alphabet, Oscar. A, B, C, D, any letter, right? And we're going to copy the letter here. Oh, give me a second, please. Permítame un segundito. Yes. Oops. Sorry. Aquí estamos. Okay. Hoy oh, sí, ahí estamos, ¿verdad? Good. Oscar, give me a letter from the alphabet, please. 
B. F. F. B. 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 This B. Yes. Yes. Okay. Give me a second. Tiene un segundito. Solo. Ah, okay. Aquí, aquí tenía apuntadas las palabras para, <ríe> para estar seguro. Okay, let it be. No, I'm sorry. So I will give you five opportunities. Five opportunities. So. Okay, uh, sorry. Okay, me? next one. Oscar. Ah, okay. <ríe> give me a second, Oscar. We're going to ask eh, Mario, please. Mario. Give me a letter uh, from the alphabet. Sorry. Letter A. Letter A. Repeat, please. Letter? Letter A. A. Good. Thank you very much. No, I'm sorry. No. Okay. Uh, after Mario, we have uh, Manuel. Manuel, give me a letter from the alphabet. You. Me? You. Me? No. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you, right? Okay. No, I'm sorry, Manuel. It's, the, it's not in the letter. Yeah. So three opportunities. Two more and... <sighs> okay. In this case, after Manuel, I have uh, Alejandro. Give me a letter from the alphabet, Alejandro. C. Letter C. Remember, uh, the topic is imperative, right? Entonces tiene que ser algún verbo por ahí, ¿no? Yes. Letter C. No. Sorry. Okay. Letter C, right? So it's four opportunities. Yes. Good. Now, after uh, Alejandro, I have Eduardo. Give me a letter from the alphabet, Eduardo. Letter L. L. Ah. Sorry, I need to give you two more opportunities. I will give you seven, seven opportunities. Solo por ser la primera palabra, le voy a dar siete oportunidades. <laughs> okay. Remember, it's imperative. Huh? Imperative. Good. Letter Now, H. En, no, Enrique, no. Jorge, please. Jorge, give me a letter, please. Letter G. Letter G. My goodness. No puede ser que no le pega ninguna. What's up? What's up? Number six. Okay, the last opportunity. Uh, Jennifer, please. M. M. No, I'm sorry. Entonces se ahorcaron. Sorry. Okay, the, the word was, listen. W. R. I T right. E, right. Right. Uh, right. Right. Right, please. Uh, that, that's a, an instruction, right? Okay, number two. Another word, right? Good. Uh, who's next? Cla uh, Beatriz, please. Letter E. Letter E. Okie dokie. Correct. Cling. Letter E, right? Okay. Letter E. Now, eh, Giovanni? Nos dijo que no, no, nos iba a dar cinco minutos. Bueno, esperémoslo. Jill, please. A letter from the alphabet. E. E. T. 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 No. T. D. D. Yes, okay, very good. Correct. Bueno, es todo lo opuesto. Hoy me están adivinando todas. Okay. Nice. Now, next one is going to be Elizabeth, right? Elizabeth? C. Letter C. Oh, no. Sorry. Okay. Next one. Esau, please. 
Remember, it's a command. It's an order. It's a verb that indicates an order. Is that who? Letter S? S. No, I'm sorry. Good. Cindy? Give me a letter from the alphabet, Cindy. M. 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 Yes. No, I'm sorry, no. Okay, Carlos. Letter R. 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 Letter R. Cling, correct. Okay. Good. Now I will give you a clue. It's a letter vowel. O. Letter O. Okay. Very good. Uh, those four. And letter O, right? Order. Congratulations, right? Okay. Another one. Good. Let's start again with uh, Carlos Enrique. Are you there, Carlos Enrique? No. Okay. So, Victor. No, no, no. Sorry. Oscar, please. After Oscar, we have Mario, right? Now, Oscar, give me a letter. Letter F? F. No, F. sorry. F. F. No. Mario? Um, e, uh, perdón, la letra E sería E, 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 uh, e yes. Eh, okay. No, sorry, it's not. Too opportunity, right? Okay, after Mario, we have Manuel. O. O. Oopsie. Oh, right. Feo, feo. Hey, come on. No estamos vendiendo, Manuel. Okay. Good. Uh, the letter O, no. Sorry, Manuel. Letter O, no. Sorry. Okay. Now, next one is Alejandro. Remember, it's a verb, right? It's un verbo. <laughs> I letter I yeah no I'm sorry good and then after Alejandro we have Eduardo right letter B letter B no I'm sorry but I will give you seven opportunities seven opportunities right now, next one is no B, is B. B? B? B, yes, the, yes. B, the, the B is the abeja, B. <laughs> okay, yes, this is the B, right? B, letter B or no? Yes. Okay, it's not, sorry, it's not. Okay, next one. Uh, Jorge sería, ¿verdad? Jorge, please. Hay bastante interferencia. Ajá, alguien tiene el micrófono, déjeme ver. Vamos, vamos a apagarlos todos. Ahorita los apagamos todos y solo Jorge me enciende el, el de él. Ok, Jorge. Please. I will give you a clue, Jorge. You use the legs. To this activity. Se usan las piernas para esta actividad, Jorge. Letter R. Letter R. No, I'm sorry. Okay, the last opportunity. 
is for Jennifer. Jennifer? And the blue? W. 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 Okay. W. Correct. W. Yes, it's correct. Okay, nice. Now, Beatriz, I will give you a clue. Letter there is a. only one but letter A. Okay, nice. You have it. Okay. And listen, it's an activity you do with your legs. Usted usa las piernas para esta actividad, okay? Good. Vamos a ver si Giovanni, hoy sí está listo, Giovanni. L. Letter L. Yes. Okay. Very good. And finally, okay. Jill. Jill, please help me. Okay. Okay, correct. My goodness. Nice. Walk, right? Walk. Okay, the last one. Only two letters. Two letters. Right? So let's begin with uh, Elizabeth, please. Elizabeth, please. G. Letter G. My goodness. Totally right. Letter G. Okay. Now, uh, after Jennifer, we have, no, after Elizabeth, we have Esau. Letter O. Letter O. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Go, right? Go. Correct. Nice. Now, we're going to practice, right? Using the imperative. Listen, please pay attention. What would you like for breakfast? Mm, I can't decide. What do you recommend? I recommend our scrambled eggs. Huevo revuelto, right? Scrambled eggs. Everybody says they're out of this world. Okay, out of this world means very delicious. When you say, for example, oh, this pupusa <laughs> is out of this world. Fuera de este mundo, right? It's, this cake is out of this world. Delicious, right? Uh, oh, maybe you say this, this pizza. Oh, I love pizza. This pizza is out of this world. Hmm? So, it's delicious, right? It's excellent, it's wonderful, it's fantastic, it's magnificent. Out of the out, out of this world, right? Now it says, I recommend our scrambled eggs. Everybody says they're out of this world. Okay, please look the imperative. Give me an order of scrambled eggs. Right? Okay. What would you like for dessert? Para el postre, dessert. Uh, I can decide. What do you recommend? I recommend our chocolate, chocolate, sorry, ice cream. Sorbete de chocolate, right? Everybody says it's delicious. Mmm, delicious, right? Okay. Please give me a dish of chocolate. Good. Now, class, repeat after me. Repeat after me. What would you like for breakfast? What would you like for breakfast? I can decide. What do you recommend? I recommend our scrambled eggs. Everybody says they're out of this world. Everybody says they're out of this world. Okay. Please give me an order of scrambled eggs. What would you like for dessert? What 
part would you like for dessert? I can decide. What do you recommend? I recommend our chocolate, chocolate, sorry, ice cream. I recommend our chocolate ice cream. Everybody says it's delicious. Everybody says it's delicious. Okay. Please give me a dish of chocolate ice cream. Please give me a dish of chocolate ice cream. Good, any question? Now it's time to practice. Good, what would you like for breakfast? I can't decide, what do you recommend? I recommend our scrambled eggs. Everybody says they're out of this world. Okay, please give me an order of scrambled eggs. Good. Now, this is pancakes for breakfast, right? And an order of. This is chicken soup for lunch, a bowl of, un tazón de, right? Un, un uh, plato, un platón, ¿no? un tazón de, de sopa, you know? Okay, to drink, a cup of coffee. Okay. Now let's try this conversation. I'm going to have Beatriz and Mario, please. Can you help me, Mario, please? Help me. So, uh, Beatriz, your letter A, right? And Mario, your letter B. Beatriz A, Mario B. And you, you are going to use pancakes for breakfast and say an order of, right? Ready? Okay. One, two, three. Ah, you're going to make substitution. Okay. Action. What would you like for breakfast? Mario? Mario? Okay, I don't know what happened with Mario now. So let me see who's going to help me. I am Eduardo. I... Ah, Mario, Mario. <laughs> Hello, Carlos, Carlos Enrique, welcome. Yes. Good, Thank I you. see. Okay, good. And Mario, Mario? No, okay. So, uh, Eduardo, help me, Eduardo. You're going to be letter B. Beatriz, can you repeat the question for Eduardo? Of course. What would you like for breakfast? Eduardo? 10-4, 10-4. Ah, good. Ah, entonces no, no, no estaba familiarizado. Nuevamente, no, no escuché, no escuché. Ok, no, pro, no problem, don't worry. Entonces, Saúl, ayúdeme, Saúl. Please. Eh, again, Beatriz, sorry. <ríe> Repeat the question. Saúl, ready? Ready, voy a intentarlo. Ok, <ríe> okay come on. Go, go ahead, go ahead, Beatriz. <ríe> What would you like for breakfast? Uh, let it be, let it be. I, I can't decide what you recommend. I recommend our pancakes. Everybody says they're out of this world. Okay, please. Hit me in 
an order of for pancakes. My no goodness, lo... yes, excellent. Very no good. Ver hasta abajo, ah, sorry, sorry. Eh, se dice order of. Mm. Ah, okay. okay, thank you, thank you very much. Now, Eduardo, hoy sí captó, ¿cómo estamos haciendo? Yes? Yes, Eduardo? Is sí, this capté, lo que pasa es que me levanté a conectar la computadora cuando me preguntó la compañera. Ah, ok, good, no problem, no problem. So, Eduardo, you're going to be letter A. Chicken okay. soup, chicken soup, right? And no, no breakfast, you said lunch, right? Okay. Now, uh, Carlos Enrique, ready? I'm ready. Okay, good. Carlos Enrique, you're going to say to be letter B, letter B, right? Okay. And this is chicken soup for lunch and a bowl, a bowl of. What do you and like for Give for me a lunch. second, give me a second. Un segundito nada más. En lugar de decir there, Van a decir it's. ¿Por qué? Los pancakes son plurales. Ajá, there. Pero la, la sopa de la pollo sopa. es plural. Ah, la so going to say it's, it's. It's out of this world. It's out of this world. Good. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Eduardo and Carlos Enrique. Action. What do you like for lunch? I can decide. What do you recommend? I recommend our about of no no uh, our chicken chicken pio pio chicken sub ah chicken again right again chicken soup is chicken soup right now again okay now what do you like for for lunch I can decide what, what you, what you recommend. I can decide I what you recommend. I recommend chicken soup for lunch. Everybody say, everybody say, it's out of the world. Okay. Please give me an order for lunch. No, no, a bowl. A bowl, a bowl of Chicken soup. Okay, a bowl of chicken soup. Chicken soup. Okay. Yeah, a bowl of chicken soup, right? Nice. Okay, now let's go to hot chocolate. Hot chocolate, right? So now I'm going to have Cindy and Carlos. Cindy, your letter A, and Carlos, your letter B. Ready? Okay. okay, one, two, Ready. three, action. What would you like for to drink? I can be too. What do you recommend? I recommend uh, or, or a hot cho chocolate. I will say there it's 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 all of the world. Okay, please give me um a cup of hot chocolate. My goodness, please. yes, congratulations, right? Give me a second, please. I need uh Carlos and, and Cindy. Do they give you uh yes, thank you. Okay, Dudley, ya estuvo, ya estuvo, Dudley. Okay, come on. Now, let's go to the next one, right? What would you like for dessert? I can decide. What do you recommend? I recommend our chocolate ice cream. Is the same the chocolate ice cream? No, I know the other one was the hot chocolate, right? Okay. Uh, everybody says it's delicious. Okay. Please give me a dish of chocolate ice cream. Good. So we have apple pie. And we have strawberries. 
you know, o sea, o sea. Al mar no le digo mar, le digo o sea, no, you know, strawberry, right? And then vanilla ice, 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 baby, to go, to go, <laughs> okay. All right, stop, collaborate and listen, I suppose, you, okay. So vanilla ice cream, you know? Good. Now, uh, let me see. ¿Quién no me ha participado? Eh... Yo, teacher. Ah. Manuel. Ok, thank you, Yo, Manuel. Teacher. And Jennifer, thank you. Manuel, you are letter A. And Jennifer, you are letter B. And you're going to say apple pie for dessert para el, el poster, right? Y apple pie se dice un pedacito de, una, un pedazo de apple pie, a piece of uh, apple pie, right? Ready? Ladies and gentlemen, directly from Tejuiste Abajo in, in La Paz. <laughs> Existe ese lugar, no crean que estoy bromeando. Tejuiste Abajo. Okay, Manuel and Jennifer, te, action. Tejuiste Arriba y Tejuiste Abajo, San Rafael mm -hmm. Orajuelo. No es Santiago Texacuango. No. San, no. San Rafael Orojo. Ok, pero se escribe así, mire, les voy a poner cómo se escribe para que vean que el teacher no está mintiendo. Sí. Y aquí lleva una como diéris, si no quiero ver. Así, te fuiste. Ok, ¿estoy equivocado, Eduardo, o así es? Es correcto. It's Congratulations, correct. teacher. No, yes, I, I speak Nahuatl. Look, the teacher speak Nahuatl. Eh, guacal. Huiste. Huiste es vidrio. Huiste. <laughs> okay, chuco. <laughs> Cuche. So, en te huiste. Bueno, se dice te huiste, pero la H se pronuncia como J a veces en Nahuatl. No sé si estoy equivocado. Por eso digo te huiste abajo. <laughs> okay. Now, let's continue. Perdón por interrumpirlos ahí. Eh, Manuel y Jennifer otra vez. Ready? Okay. Ready. One, two, three, action. What would you like for this? I am glad. This is what do you recommend. I recommend our apple pie. Everybody say it delicious. Okay. Fly, please. You mean a piece of chocolate? No, no, a it's piece, crumb. a piece. Sorry, Jennifer. A, a piece, of, piece of, of. A piece of chocolate is cream. No, 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 no. A, a piece of apple pie. Apple pie. No, lo que pasa es que Jennifer quiere también chocolate, quiere también la, la fresa, <laughs> el todo, ¿verdad? No, no, Jennifer, solo uno, lo siento. Ok. <laughs> solo el apple pie, uh, okay. ok. Ok, ok, please. Please give me a this piece of apple pie. Apple, ¿Cómo se dice? Apple pie. pie. Apple, apple, pie. Apple, apple, apple pie. Apple pie. Apple pie. Ok, very good. Thank you. Thank you very much, right? Good. Ok, ¿quién me faltó entonces? Solo eh, Jorge, Jorge ya me participó. No, teacher. No, no, va. Entonces Jorge y Carlos Enrique ya me participó. Sí, ¿verdad? Ya me participó, pero ayúdame otra vez, Carlos Enrique. Carlos Enrique. Hey, teacher. Uh, ok, Giovanni. Ah, Giovanni no ha participado, sí. Giovanni, yo, eh, in strawberries, Giovanni, you are... Salvado por la campana. Salvado por la campana. Giovanni lo salvó. <laughs> ok, Giovanni, you are letter A and Jorge is letter B, right? Yeah. Ok. Como, perdón, como dijo que se pronuncia, porque también acá hay una palabra... Uh, strawberries. Uh, strawberries. Uh, straw, straw, uh -huh, strawberries, strawberries, dessert, mm -hmm. dessert, dessert, a bowl yes, of, a bowl, a bowl of, a bowl of, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. que es un tazón, por ejemplo, cuando ustedes ven el, el Super Bowl, ya, es el, el Super Tazón, 
super tazón. Ah, entonces, okay. bowl es como, como un plato, una ¿no? Una <risa> Yes, una bocalada de fresa. <risa> Con aguas. Ah, no. Ok, una, ready. Una perolada. Oh, una perolada. <risa> ok, one, two, three, action. ¿Quién comienza? <risa> Yo. Okay. <risa> okay. 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 What would you like for dessert? I can't decide. What do you like recommend? recommend? I recommend or is strawberry. Strawberry. Everybody said they are. They are. They are. They uh, are. Everybody. They are. Uh -huh, they are delicious okay okay please give me a this no a bowl a bowl a, a bowl a, a bowl a strawberry okay thank you thank you very much good do you understand so we still have time for one more right two volunteers please for the vanilla ice cream Two volunteers. Ya pasaron todos, pero alguien que quiera reengancharse, alguien que le esté dando sueño por ahí. Yo. <laughs> okay. Alejandro and Carlos Enrique. Vanilla ice cream for dessert a dish of, right? Ready? One, two, three, action. What would you like for dessert? I can decide. I can. You recommend. I recommend. Our vanilla ice cream, everybody says they, they are delicious. No, no, it's, it's, it's. It, it, it. Delicious. Excuse me. Okay. Please give me a dish of vanilla ice cream. Please. Okay. Congratulations. Mira, estoy super feliz. Estamos, estamos desarrollando las conversaciones bien natural, ¿verdad? Eh, a los que tengan problemas con pronunciación les voy a dar una técnica vale, pero presten atención eh, muchos de ustedes tienen Netflix HBO Max o, o Disney ¿verdad? Eh, o si no pues tienen también YouTube o, o el cable común y corriente entonces uh, las películas de muñequitos oiga bien, de muñequitos no de grandes ni de, de acción porque ahí solo malas palabras dicen <ríe> son Your mother, ok, solo es palabra, o sea, se oye entonces, pero no. Eh, quiero que vean películas de muñequitos como Sing, uh, Toy Story, Shrek, Kung Fu Panda. Yo la Mario, veo por la... mi sobrino. Jefe. Ah, pues póngase sí, las en inglés, que... Manuel. Manuel, póngase las en inglés. Si vos pasas aquí, de Kung Fu Panda. Ah, a mí Eso me fascina la de... <ríe> A mí me gusta cuando, este, ¿cómo lo hiciste? ¿Cómo? No sé, solo estire los brazos. Los subtítulos, la verdad, que <ríe> Ok, pero los subtítulos deben ser en inglés. Óigame bien. Subtítulos okay. en inglés. Películas de muñequitos, subtítulos en inglés. Vaya. Entonces, cuando les vaya apareciendo los subtítulos abajo, ustedes van a ir leyendo, pero no mentalmente, sino que decirlo, ¿ya? Si ahí en su casa, su mamá, su tío, su hermano, quien sea que esté ahí, vos estás loco ahí, solo repitiendo, ah, ignórenlo. Ustedes sigan practicando, ¿sí? Si ustedes ven una película por semana, en cuatro meses, les aseguro que ustedes van a estar pronunciando, ve, ¿eh? que toque, ¿sí? Pero es una disciplina, ¿ve? ¿eh? Una disciplina así constante, ¿ok? Ok, gracias que, por la recomendación. Para, para todo va la recomendación, ¿sí? Eh, inclusive en YouTube a veces aparecen las películas con subtítulos, entonces ahí ustedes van a repetir. Obviamente no van a repetir todo, ¿sí? Solo quiero que repitan partecitas nada más, pedacitos. Algo que ustedes entiendan y que, y que les parezca atractivo para repetir, vayan repitiendo. Y así por, en toda la película, ¿verdad? ¿Ok? 
A veces yo veo en esta clase que alguien de repente se le enciende el micrófono y, y descubrimos que está, digamos, estamos leyendo y él va leyendo aquí. El estudiante que encendió la, el micrófono dice, ah, recomiendo el chocolate. Ahí sí se ve la voz de la, del, del alumno que está eh, leyendo. Más de alguno de ustedes le ha haber pasado, ¿no? Entonces, eso quiero con las películas que están viendo, ¿no? Van viendo las películas y van repitiendo. Ok, and then the, they hit the, the bird, Kung Fu Panda. Yeah. Ok, and then you repeat, right? Repeat. Good. Y otra recomendación a todos los que nos hemos quedado con los cursos de, eh, con los 10 minutos extra, ¿verdad? Siempre les hago la misma recomendación, música. Hoy les envío una canción. Vamos a ver cómo se llama la canción. ¿Qué envía ahora? No creo. No, era una canción de, de reggae. Y lo reggae. You love. And be love. Ok, ahí está. Entonces. Apréndanse esa canción y repitan y repitan y repitan hasta que se la aprendan, ¿sí? A la par de la canción, vean la letra y van repitiendo, ¿sí? Es súper fácil y la música se mete en una parte del cerebro que es más fácil que se quede. Por eso de repente usted está bañando, usted está planchando, usted de repente le viene una canción en la mente y dice, Could you be love? Ah, ok. Sí, así que esas son las recomendaciones para mejorar la pronunciación, ¿ok? Muy bien, eh, ¿cómo vamos con la...? Bueno, aquí hay otro, hay otra actividad, pero ya no nos queda tiempo. Solo quiero saber cómo vamos con la, con la plataforma. Eh, el último reporte que revisé, se lo voy a leer, ¿verdad? Eh, los únicos que tenían 10 hasta el momento que yo revisé, no sé si ya las corrigieron, era eh, Cristina, Esaú, eh, Jill, Giovanni, eh, Beatriz, Jennifer, Jorge, eh, Enrique, Alejandro, Manuel, eh, Oscar, Oscar Andrés, en Carlos Enrique. Bueno, ellos, ellos tenían 10 cuando yo lo revisé ayer, creo. Sí, ayer lo revisé. Hoy no lo he revisado, ya lo vamos a revisar y actualizarlo, ¿verdad? Eh, a los demás que han sacado 80, pueden llegar al 100. Y a los que no han hecho nada, por favor, hagamos los ejercicios que están regalados. Ah, al finalizar esta clase, ya tenemos que haber hecho de la unidad 2, la tarea 1, no, perdón, la tarea 6 y la tarea 7. ¿Sí? Vamos a, a revisarla, ¿les parece? Aquí estos ejercicios se los voy a mandar en los voy a mandar en cómo se llama al grupo solo era de cómo cocinar un estofado de, de vegetales verdad y ahí está dando las instrucciones y en la otra era cómo hacer una un cake de, de frutas no un pastel de frutas y ahí va dando las instrucciones miren agregar aquí agregar allá cortar por aquí etcétera etcétera bueno pero quiero compartir con ustedes la la, ¿Cómo se llama la plataforma? Regálenme un segundito. Solo vamos a abrir. Ok. Uh, aquí estamos. Abrir la plataforma. De... Regálenme un segundito. Aquí estamos. En lo que se abre, vamos a, a solicitar. Ahí está. Ahí está. La tengo ya. Ahí se está abriendo. Voy a solicitar el alumno que se va a quedar conmigo esta noche en la sesión de uno con, a uno a uno. Eh, tengo a, programado a Beatriz. ¿Se puede quedar conmigo esta noche, Beatriz? Diez minutos. Ok. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Good. Ahí está agendada ya. Ok. Ahorita les comparto la plataforma y vamos a revisar las las tareas que estaba para ayer y para ahora, ¿ok? Ya pasamos la unidad 1, ahora estamos en la unidad 2. Ongoing activities at the workplace, right? Y este tiene 
cinco tareas. Al terminar las cinco tareas, cada tarea vale, vale, vale 20. <ríe> vale 20, qué feo soy yo. <ríe> cada tarea vale, tiene el valor de 20. <ríe> Así soy mejor, ¿va? Ok. Eh, y aquí tenemos el video del día de ayer. ¿sí? El de ahora no está, obviamente, porque ahorita se está grabando. Ok, y tenemos la tarea 6. Vale, muy bien. Uh, estamos viendo los, los, adverbios de fre, los adverbios de frecuencia y las expresiones que indican frecuencia, ¿verdad? Principalmente, bueno, aquí sería, uh, do you go to the dentist? ¿Con qué frecuencia va al dentista? How seldom, how often, or how many? Luego dice, she never, every day, or always takes a shower. Okay. Solo van a ir escogiendo una de las opciones con referencia a los adverbios de frecuencia. Okay. Si se equivocan, la plataforma les da la oportunidad de corregir. Es decir, el que no se saque 10 aquí, porque. <risa> ¿Verdad? Y tenemos esta tarea. Esta es la tarea de ahora. Ahora vimos los imperativos. Miren, aquí debe ir un verbo, sin sujeto. Then check, supervise. ¿Cuál de esos es? Y luego dice el personal. ¿Qué se hace con el personal? Se envía por correo al personal, se chequea al personal o se supervisa al personal. ¿Ok? Luego, the potential customers, los clientes potenciales. Memos to the office. The report. A letter. Use blue English. ¿Ok? Muy bien, estas son las tareas que tenemos que hacer, ¿sí? Yo considero que hasta ahorita son sencillas, porque lo bueno en la plataforma usted no hay forma de que se equivoque, porque si, si se equivocó, ahí puede, puede corregir, ¿sí? Any question, class? ¿Hay alguna pregunta? Ok, eh, su nota está basada en tres actividades. Actividad 1, la plataforma. Todas las tareas de la plataforma. Actividad 2, esta clase es Zoom. Cuando usted se conecta, ¿verdad? Usted ya está ganándose la nota. Y la, la, la tercera es una encuesta que vamos a hacer al final del, del curso. Este día estamos jueves, sería la, la clase 7. El mañana sería la clase 8. La clase 9 sería hasta el martes 2, porque el, el primero de mayo no hay clases, ni el primero ni el 10 de mayo, no hay clases. Entonces, eh, el día de mañana tendríamos la, la clase 8. Permítame, hay un micrófono por ahí. Ok, y el martes tendríamos la clase 9. El miércoles 3 estaríamos haciendo el examen de medio curso, ¿sí? Me imagino que Carlos Enrique ya va un poquito adelantado por ahí, ¿verdad, Carlos Enrique? Está bien. Yo me, es que me Usted ya va adelantado en la plataforma, ¿verdad? No, 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 no. ya voy, voy alineado. Va, vamos alineado, no, pero se puede, no, mire, no es un regaño ni nada, está bien. Si puede hacerlo, puede adelantarse, no hay problema. Pueden hacerlo, ¿verdad? Ok, muy bien. ¿Hay alguna pregunta? Va, entonces paso lista y pueden irse a la camita ya, ok, solo me voy a quedar con Beatriz so, eh, Carlos Carlos present teacher ok, have a estaba, good night estaba haciendo, estaba haciendo lo de, plata, de la plataforma ah, vaya, excelente. buena excusa, sí, sí que no hay problema lo felicitamos no. Carlos yes. no, no, cuando digo buena excusa es buena, buen motivo pues no, no me tomé mm. mal Gila, ahí está Buenas, noche. <ríe> Buenas, Buenas noches, noche. Carlos. Ok. Eh, Cindy. Present. Present. Thank you very much. Have a good night. Esaú. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Elizabeth. Good night, teacher. Good night. God bless you. Jill. Present. Good night. Good night, Giovanni. 
here, teacher. Good night. Thank you. Good night, Beatriz. Present. Thank you. Jennifer. Good night, teacher. Thank you, Jorge. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. See you tomorrow, Jorge. Eduardo. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, Alejandro. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Ma okay, thank you, Manuel. Good night, teacher. Good night, Mario. Good night, teacher. Good night. Eh, Oscar. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. God bless you. Carlos Enrique. Present teacher. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow, right? Night. You Eduardo, tomorrow. Ya, ya lo mencioné, Eduardo. Yes. Yes. Okay. Very good. Thank you very much. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Okay. Hello, Beatriz. How are you? Hi, teacher. Mm. Tired. <laughs> tired. Yes, a little bit. Yeah, tired. I imagine. No. So much yes. tired. <laughs> a lot of tired, right? A lot of tired. But uh, do you have babies, Beatriz? Yes. Oh, yes. I understand. <laughs> <laughs> yes, working and having babies. Ooh. Yeah, good. And it's a boy, right? Yes. Uh huh. You, you show you show him. Let's let is Andre. No. Yes. Yes. Sí. Oh, Andre. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, he needs a lot of work, right? A lot mm -hmm. of time too. And yes, he's three years old. Two. Two years old. Ah, yes. The famous two you say last time, right? <laughs> they are tremendous, yes. And but beautiful. Yeah. They, yes. Okay, uh, Beatriz, I don't know if you have any question about any topic that we have developed in this class. The imperatives, the simple present. For the moment, I'm okay. You're okay. Good. Yes. So what do you think of the class? Do you like it? Yes, I like it. Yes. Do you have any recommendation? Only speak English? No, no. no. That's no, no good. That's perfect. <laughs> okay, good. So what about the techniques you use to practice your English? Because your English is really good. Let me tell you. Thank your you. your Thank English you. is really good. Your pronunciation, the grammar, etc., etc. Do you have any technique to study? Mm, like you said, I watch... Uh, Movies mm, with okay. subtitles and listen to music usually. Uh huh. And in my you remember, work. and your work they permit you to practice. No, no, no. I I listen to music in my work uh, because we sell ah. a professional audio and all day we are listening music. So I I put my my English music. I understand. So you are working and then you listening to me. Oh, yes. okay. That's yes. nice. <laughs> no, no, because in some words it's not permitted, right? To listen to music. Yes. In my case, uh, listen, I work in a school, in a public school. So sometimes I lose I listen to the music, but in the break. So but in class, because I speak in so yeah. I'm teaching, it's not possible, right? But nice that you have the opportunity to to practice your 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 English with music, right? How about movies? What, what, what was the last movie you saw? The movie where the last is um, Tangled. 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 Enredados. Uh, I know. Uh, I know the movie. And Ooh, the, one, the, one pri the Princess and the Frog is one of my song's favorite in cars. <laughs> <laughs> and no, listen, I, I imagine uh, he, he asked for the movie. Uh, vroom, vroom, time again and the again. Cars. <laughs> the Lightning McQueen, right? The Lightning the McQueen. Frog, the frog, the princess and the frog. <laughs> and then you put it in English, right? Yes. Because she, he to can't he can't understand, and I can practice too. <laughs> of course. So Andre, when he's he just uh, watches seven, <laughs> seven, eight, so he's going to 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 understand English. So I hope. Speaks, I yeah. hope it. Yes. And also in, in, in the internet, there are a lot of uh, songs in English, right? So can YouTube, right? You know, the famous little finger, little finger. Where? Yes, yes, yes. I am. 
He has Lido a chat. He has books. He has oh. books. And In English? He, one of his favorite is um, the spider. It's a bitsy spider. So I sing him ah, in English. A it's a, it's a I know. Spider, it's a climb out the spout yeah. again. And, and uh -huh. he likes he likes it. <laughs> okay, I might. And uh, it, he's very ah. There, there it is, uh, Andre, right? Hey, Andre. Hello. Here is. Okay. Uh, hi, Andre. Hi. How are you? Nice Hello. to see you. Eh? You. Do you like Lightning McQueen? I love Lightning McQueen. It's a very good movie. Nice. Vroom, 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 vroom. Yes, I love it. Hola, Hi. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> A dinosaur. And here I have another. Andre, look. Andre, look. I have uh, Dino. Dino is the name. <gasps> Hi, Andre. <laughs> I am a dinosaur. Yes. Yeah. Brr. No, I don't like cars. I like to eat other dinosaurs. <laughs> no, no, it's a green. Dino. Dinosaur. Yeah. Good. Goodbye. Goodbye. Take care. Good boy. It's late. You're still uh, awake, but <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye. <laughs> okay. So he understands. He understands them. A little bit, I think. Mm, baby. No, no, but, but believe, no, no. I will tell you this, uh, Beatriz. According to the experts, we humans can learn four languages from the from the belly when when they are in the in the belly of the mother until the four years. So uh, Andre is in the exactly time to learn at least four languages. <laughs> Can you imagine? So your brain is capable to have to learn four languages. So he he can and he understands he understands. But the problem is that if you stop this technique in the future, he will forget the 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 words and etc cetera, etc. Cetera. So what you can do is try to to show him. Only in English, right? Uh, but he can practice Spanish, of course, in in the kinder when he he goes to the kinder. So don't worry about the the two languages. Uh, last time, uh, a family member, right? Uh, my sister-in-law, by the way, uh, the teacher of uh, her daughter says that don't teach English because in in, in my class, uh, we speak Spanish and she's speaking English. And then, what? I mean, that was the problem that if, he, if, if you can speak English and Spanish at the same time, uh, the problem is that the other don't understand, maybe, right? The other kids don't understand, but but that's not a problem. I mean, you can teach Andres Spanish and in, in, in English, right? So no, not a problem. And 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 it will develop his brain also, because when you learn two languages, your mind is more open, right? According to the expert, don't believe the teacher. <laughs> Let's believe the the expert, right? Okay, very good, uh, Beatriz. I I I want to tell you thank you because you you already you helped me a lot in my class. Yes, when when some students don't don't know the answer, they say Beatriz, help me. <laughs> Help me. So I really appreciate your help. And, and again, congratulations because your pronunciation is really good. And also your grammar, right? Thank so you. So any, any extra commentary before we finish? No one. You're okay. <laughs> no one. Okay. Thank you very much. God bless you and see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye.